Good morning, guys. We're at Animal Kingdom this morning. We've got a uh, pretty fun day planned. We're gonna yeah, rope we're, drop. We're rope dropping. And we're rope dropping extra magic hours. Ooh. Which we normally avoid parks on extra magic hour days. I but can't see anything. It just worked out really well. So we're gonna rope drop a uh, flight of passage and then we've got a few fast passes. We're gonna get to do uh, Donald's Dino Bash yeah, for the first time. I'm most excited about that. Yeah, we're pretty excited to see Chip and Dale in their outfits. Yes! And uh, yeah, it's gonna be a fun day. So let's go. walking up to the gate and I don't know how we've never noticed before but they've got purple martin nests out here it's pretty cool let me turn the mic around and see if you can hear them All right, so because it's extra magic hours, there's a second touch point that you have to go through uh, to scan your magic band that you're a resort guest. It's so, party though. Yeah, but it's my party. So only one person in your party has to scan. So we made it through in really good time through both sets of stanchions and we're headed back to Flight's Passage. <laughs> So as is typical with uh, rope dropping this ride, we found out they send you up through this back corridor instead of through the full queue, which is slightly disappointing because we really like seeing everything in the lab. Um, but this is definitely a faster way to move the line in the morning when the rope drop crowd is here. So we don't get to go in there. How was Flight of Passage? Always good. I love it every time. Um, I think I figured out my two favorite things though. The first one is um, when you go through the water, like no spoilers, but there's a big wave and I love that. And the second is the smell when you're in like the cave that's bioluminescent. It smells like Fruit Loops to me. Do you guys think it smells like Fruit Loops? So as is typical at Rope Drop, the Flight of Passage line is backed up into Africa. So they just told somebody about an 80 minute wait. We're 25 minutes into uh, extra magic hours, so the park isn't even open yet. So we're done. We rode both rides in Pandora and we're headed to take a safari. over in Dino Land USA now. We're gonna get a quick ride on Dinosaur and then see what we can see of uh, Donald's Dino Bash. So it's still a little early, so we might have to wait a little bit, but uh, that's next on the agenda. We just rode Dinosaur and we had no friends. None. It's nine o'clock and so Extra Magic Hours are officially over and the park is open. So in that time, we were able to ride um, Flight of Passage 
and then Navi River Journey. Yeah. Then we walked on to Expedition Everest. Yeah. And then we came over and rode Dinosaur with yeah. no weight at all. So four of the main attractions by 9 o'clock is not bad. And we spent a little extra time walking the Kilimanjaro Safaris that wasn't yeah. open. And it's open now. Yeah. Um, but we have Fast Pass for that later. Um, so I would say our suggestion is if you are a resort guest to do... Uh, extra magic hour the morning extra magic hour in animal kingdom but i would say that with a caveat wouldn't you like yeah you've got to be a rope dropper rope dropper and not rope drop as in like oh it's from eight to nine so we're gonna get there at eight like we were in line at 7 15 yeah 7 15 and we're able to do that by the time we came off of flight of passage it truly was an 80 minute wait yeah at 8 15 it was an 80 minute wait i think if you were to get here right at eight o'clock when it starts you maybe could have done two of those rides yeah the other rides and then waited for flight of passage like that would have been your other option right so it was a long wait by the time we got off of it at 805 yeah so. it was pretty pretty rough. um and then i would also suggest if you're not a resort guest that flight of passage line isn't getting any shorter anytime no, stay soon. Away. <laughs> i would stay away from this park if you're not a resort guest on early early morning not early morning magic <laughs> extra, extra magic, magic hours, hours in the morning. Yep. Two totally different things. They gotta stop saying like, <laughs> putting them all together. We've got a lot of other stuff planned though, so let's go see what else we can do in the park. We are in line to see Chippendale. They start meeting in about 15 minutes. The first cast member we saw told us that they met around front, so we were the first people in line. He's like, this doesn't seem right. I feel like more people would want to see Chippendale in their dinosaur outfit. So we pulled up the app, and sure enough, here's the line. Hello. Hey. Big waves. Hey, big waves. Big waves. Um, <laughs> it's all about Chip today. It's fuzzy like you are. It's perfect. Now it's all about Dale. <laughs> and the Keisha, how was that? Oh my god. They're so precious. <laughs> like, I just like wanted to cry. I love them so much. <laughs> Hi, Daisy. Did you make everyone's outfits? Those are, those are all your designs. They're amazing, as usual. Will you show us some of your things you've got here? All your books. Oh yeah. 50 years of McDuck Enterprises. That's wonderful. A dinosaur statue. That's great. And so we got to meet three characters, or a few characters. There's three more we didn't. Here's Donald, that's one of them. And he's got his hat with the dinosaur feathers on it. It's really cool. Over here, close to Primeval World and Triceratops Spin, is Goofy, who is meeting and greeting as the uh, carnival runner. So he's got a carnival outfit on. It's pretty cool. And Pluto is doing a meet and greet over here inside the Boneyard. We're going to see if we can get inside here and see what Pluto's up to. So here's Pluto over here. He's helping kids look for bones. <laughs> The last thing that we have planned for the morning slash afternoon is Kilimanjaro Safari, but Dinosaur has been down uh, part of the morning, so they're accepting fast passes for it. So there's a ridiculously long fast pass line. Um, we heard people earlier saying they were waiting in the fast pass line for close to an hour, but we seem to be moving pretty well. Um, but they said it was because of dinosaurs fast passes being accepted over here and uh, some animals that blocked the road for a really long time earlier. They're having a hard time catching the line back up. So. We'll see, this is the last thing we have planned, so we don't mind waiting for a little bit. But uh, yeah, pretty ridiculous line for Fast Pass Return for Kilimanjaro Safari. I'll call bongos. 
Bongos are known as the ghosts of the forest for their ability to blend in with their environment. Both the male and female bongos will have horns that will face backwards, and that will help them navigate through the brush more easily. We are now entering the Safi River area. Now hippos are able to sleep underneath water, coming up periodically for air in the world and the main source of protein for them will be fish so they, they can reach heights around 20 feet tall but their tongue is around 18 or 20 inches long and it's and that's how they're able to evade predators you can begin to see the herd i cannot stop here because it is a blind spot for the elephant calf up on the left hand side there and she is quite unique because she has yet to develop her tusk. She is so cute. Playing in the water. Here's back and forth. Yeah, get that itch. To help back and forth to pick up a... So unfortunately, sometimes when we're in the park, we have technical difficulties. <laughs> and this is one of those times. The audio just straight up didn't record. So... Keisha, what do you think we were saying here? Um, I think we were saying it was really hot because oh, it was, it was um, that it was a great early morning yeah. and that we absolutely love Animal Kingdom because that's typically what we say at the end of all of the Animal Kingdom videos. And we videos. have all of the Animal Kingdom videos. We tried to lip read, but mm -mm. all I could tell it is it was happening. hot, but that yeah. was it. But we had a great time. Make sure you guys <laughs> like the video, comment down below with your favorite thing in Animal Kingdom. And subscribe to the channel so the bare necessities of life will come to you. Also, don't forget to follow us on Instagram, at bare necessities. We'll Bye. see you guys in the parks. Donald, Don, Don, uh, never mind. <laughs> you can say it. Never mind.